team member accesses project status report. So let's go back to Oracle applications and I'm going to show you first the approval side of things and then we'll take it further to see how the project team members can access the project status report published by the project manager. So I'm going to minimize this and then I'm going to go to Oracle applications. So presently I'm logged in as Emmy Marlin, the project manager, which is associated with this user services. So I'm going to log out from here. And if you recall from the last movie, we have sent that project status report for approval from Casey Brown. So let's log in as Casey Brown. And then hit the login button. And from here, and as you could see on the dashboard itself, the project status report workflow has sent a notification to Casey Brown from Emmy Marlin and with a subject of detailed health check status report 30th October 2015 requires your approval. So click on this one and within that you can look at the whole report that's submitted by Emmy Marlin and if you are happy with this report then you can proceed ahead and simply hit the approve button so upon approval it's going to send another notification to Emmy Marlin it's going to close that notification so let's log out from Casey Brown go back to Emmy Marlin so log in with the services user and then on the dashboard you will see a notification you can see that so this has been published it's been approved and published automatically. If you recall in the project status report itself, we have given the checkbox stating that as soon as the approval sort is given, then publish the report. So from here, we'll open the notification which we received after the project status report has been approved. You can see the details over here that at what time the report was submitted for approval, who has submitted the report for approval and who has approved the report and which date it was approved. If at all any note was written by Casey Brown, it would have been visible over here. And secondly, if the status report would have been rejected, then again, the rejection reason would be visible over here and the notification would contain rejected instead of approved. So that being said, we'll go back to home. We'll look, have a look at the other notification which the system generated automatically because the publishing after approval has happened automatically. So it's pretty much the same thing what you saw, but it contains the report information over here. Okay. And then we'll go back to the project and we'll go to project status dashboard. So we'll go to vision services responsibility for project manager and then go to project delivery go to project list and within this one now navigate to the project list within that go to the project that we have been working for this demo so building 100 construction and if you had included a team member list then all those team members would be able to view the project status from their team member vision services responsibility respectively. So now I'm going to go back to the reporting tab and within this one I will go to project status hyperlink. Okay, so click on status reports and then as you could see now the report status if you go into this maintain status reports or health check assessment you would see that the report that we just created now it comes from unpublished reports to published reports okay at any point you see that the report is obsolete you can make that obsolete by clicking on this obsolete button okay and you can click on that to see the report information that has been published okay so with this I'm gonna go back to status report and here you can click on report history to see what all has happened this is the dashboard okay 
and this report has been published. The other thing I wanted to know, show you was if at all a team member was added as a part of this project report publishing, then he would have got a notification for for that and he could view the report right by going to the responsibility team member vision services USA and within that you can go to team member home where the notification would have been displayed or as an alternate if he has got access to project status dashboard then he would be able to see it over here as well okay and you can also create a shortcut for project status dashboard right from here within team members dashboard so that he don't have to go to the home page search the responsibility and come he can directly click on the shortcut here and hit the go button just like what I have done for such requirements so if we had a project status report as one of the shortcuts we could have selected that hit the go button it would have saved time so that's in summary how you create and publish project status report seek approval and automatically publish and then how team members can view it on their dashboard